Welcome to JTMJ Crafts. My name's Jeremy. If you happen to be new here, welcome to the family. How's everybody's day going? I hope it's spectacular. Today I'm working on Crafty Mint. You can see the image right here. Kind of sitting up there so you guys can see it. So, today... I'm going to be working on this, of course, and talking about a question I get asked, uh, asked quite a bit. Um, it's, it's a YouTube question. It's a moderator question. Usually happens after a live stream. Or a day or so later. Uh, could even happen a week later. Um, so, basically, the question I get asked almost every single weekend is, Who are the people in blue? I'm like, what do you mean people in blue? What do you mean men in black? No, they're in blue. I'm like, sorry, I don't know what you're talking about. You're in your live stream, they're blue. I'm like, oh, gotcha. So, the people in blue in my live streams, those are people who are moderators. Now, before I say anything else, I'm going to put this out there. This is 100% my opinion. I know each and every each and every one of you have your own opinion. This is mine, so yeah, let's just put that out there first. Second, my opinion: a moderator is somebody who is on troll alert. So. Who's ever stream I go to, I'm always kicking back, diamond painting, and my phone's right here in front of me, and I'm watching. And as soon as I see something, boom, gone. Right? So, then I was asked, well, why are they so special? They're in blue. But they're my moderators. I've hand selected people who spend time in my chats on Saturday nights. We have, I, th I think we have a pretty good time. But those are also people. That I feel like I've gotten to know the past so many, however months it may have been, what not, what not. So it's all you spend time on my channel, I'll make you a moderator. My opinion the more moderators you have, the less I have to do. So, then I'm always asked, well, why is there only certain ones who are blue? Because those are the ones I, f I have come closer with. Doesn't mean that other people aren't going to be blue. I just haven't gotten to know people. Some of the newer people, you know? How do you post links? I'll be a moderator. And I'm like, well, you gotta show up and talk. You gotta show up and say, hey. It's just a question that's asked all the time. And I try to explain it. You know, Can you make a video? Yeah, I could do that. That's that's easier than trying to explain all of this over a 
a message. But the reason why I'm saying this is because they think, oh, they're just helping you watch the trolls. Yes and no. A moderator has multiple jobs, in my opinion. A moderator is supposed to ask people to smash the like button. Show the host some love. And then a moderator is also supposed to say... Friday nights, Miss Coffee's live. I know Mrs. Coffee's and Rachel Ray's Facebook group. I go get their link and I I post it all night long. Yes, I'm there the whole time. I may not talk a lot because I'm working a lurk and then I'm troll watching. But I am there and trying to get this done. Trying to get Projects done. Um, an update on some project. The Native American beating. I'm waiting. I placed another order. Because that yellow was a different size. And I didn't want to work with this different size yellow. So I placed another order. And then I, I bought um, a, a kit of the clasp and stuff like that. So that stuff should be here in the next week or so. Are you dreaming, son? You okay? Okay. Ah. Sorry. I was something thirsty. I have chalky milk over here. Don't say it. I, I, don't tease me because I say it funny. I don't care. <clears throat> Growing up, I could never say chocolate. I used to say chalky. Chalky milk. Chalky milk. And everybody learned to know what chalky milk is. So, I'm drinking chalky milk tonight. Anyways, squirrel over here. So, a moderator's job, my opinion, is drop links, drop uh, whatever links that you know of that person has, a Facebook group, Instagram, PayPal, all that good stuff. And I just want to give a big, big shout out to Sister Cassie. Sister, you are a rock star all night long in my life. Just dropping them links. Dropping the Vibe Tribe Facebook group. And that's another thing. Why are you advertising for Vibe Tribe? Because I'm part of Vibe Tribe. I represent the Vibe Tribe. He sits right behind my chair and like pushes me in further. I'm comfortable where I'm at. Crazy, crazy, crazy. So, I'm, I'm, just, I'm like all over the place. I found something that I tried tonight. I ordered it online. This is the first time I've tried it, and I'm in awe right now. Like I have no pain right now. I, I. I'm, like, I'm still in beyond belief. I, seriously, I don't know. It is crazy. It is called Hemp Vana. And it is legally sold here. And it's made out of hemp stuff. And it's a, basically like a muscle rub. Oh, I am in, I have seriously no pain. I'm like, I, I don't, 
I don't even know what to say. Like, seriously. I'm shocked. Like, my back. Pain free. My sciatica, my hip. Pain free. My hand. Because this knuckle always, always hurts when it gets cold. I rubbed it on, all right here, let it dry, like five minutes later, no pain. I can actually almost close my hand all the way. It, I'm, I'm speechless, seriously. So anyways, that's my opinion of a moderator and I thank each and every one of my moderators. I feel like I have an awesome group. A lot of people just think a moderator is just to watch for trolls. My opinion is not. It's for doing a lot of things. You're her or his right hand man. You know what I'm saying? That way they don't have to stop. Or I don't have to stop. What I'm doing, I'll hold on, get my phone, or get my, you know, microphone, microphone, what the hell am I saying? My computer, look something up, I'm thinking about singing, I've been singing all day, I, uh, I'm just in a good mood lately, like, I, I don't know, it's kind of weird. I'm just luckily that Trapper hasn't bit my hand today. Yeah, if you don't know the reason why this hand is like, like this. One, I used to punch too much stuff. Two, Trapper hurt it when he was a puppy. He was chewing on it one night, and I was playing with him, and he, I turned around to grab something, and he had his mouth all the way up in here like this, and his canine went down between right there, and whoo, yeah, I was like, ah, singing opera. Ever since then, my hand has just been messed up. I don't know what he did, but like that, ah, yeah, it hurt. So, I just want to touch base with that. It's just a question I get a lot. And then I wanted to update you guys with life with me um, <laughs> nothing really important uh, just want to let you guys know that I am going to be without power again um, Wednesday morning the day you see this you'll be without power which is going to suck because they said it could be three to four days. So, hopefully, bye. <clears throat> Excuse me. Chocolate milk got me off Fleming. There we go. Um, possibly Friday night or 
Thursday or Saturday morning. I hope they get figured out soon. Because now they're saying that the reason why they're not the reason why they're shutting power off is for maintenance. It's not because of high wind alerts. It's not because weather's going to be crazy or anything like that, like they were t telling us. So now they say they're fixing power poles and power lines because there was a bunch that was damaged during the fire last year, damage from being in the ground for a hundred years. So they they were needed to, uh, I think they said it was like 3,500 new telephone poles they were putting in the ground. So there was a lot of work, supposedly, that they're doing. Which is fine if you're updating stuff. Tell us that you're updating stuff. I mean, I didn't care because I went to go pay my pg and &E bill this, this month and uh, I didn't have a bill. I walked in and he said, yeah, I want to pay this bill. And she goes, okay, Jeremy. She pulls it up. Um, she goes, here you go. And I'm like, what's this? This is what I just gave you. And she goes, yeah, you don't have a bill. You had a $150 credit. And I was like, sweet. Go buy me a new pair of boots. Anyways. So... <clears throat> that's cool so the next this month the next last month and this month will be paid for for electricity because my bill is only like 70 bucks my electricity bill's low it's like 70 bucks and that's with three fish tanks running and all that good stuff I was hoping to go to the, the pet store tomorrow and buy a puffer fish because they finally got uh, freshwater puffer fish in and I was excited but then I heard about the power shut off and I was like damn it as soon as I get this fish in it's got a power shut off sorry And it's like, are you serious? I've been wanting this fish forever. Well, I've been thinking about getting a puffer fish for a while. But, supposedly they have one on hold for me. But I don't know how long that's going to last. I told them to put two on hold. Because I want two. Because they're little tiny little things. So two of them in a 10 gallon aquarium is plenty. They only get like uh, maybe inch and a half to two inches. So they don't get very big at all. Which is going to be cute. Uh, let's see. No, no, get in there. Get, yep, over there. Um, I need a piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. Let's see, what was I going to say? Nope, enough for you, boy. This has got chocolate in it. This is chocolate peanut butter with chocolate and peanut butter. Yeah. No. Have you guys ever had those uh, Reese's Peanut Butter Cups with the Reese's Pieces inside of it? Oh yeah. Mm, 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 mm. I told you, you can't have none. Oh, Lord.
lordy, lordy, lordy. So, I got my secret Santa package. And if you guys didn't notice, I opened it in my Saturday live stream. If you'd like to see it, go back and watch that Saturday live stream. Uh... Um, I don't know exactly a time frame when I opened it. I'd say probably a half an hour in or so. Roughly. I opened it. I was so excited. So I've been playing with my oh hoo -hoos. Yep. Um... Then the printer decided it wanted to run out of ink over there, so that that pissed me off and rubbed me the wrong way. It's like, God, I wanted to color. I did color a little bit, but uh, as you can see, the bottom is bright and vibrant and dark lines. And the top is just real faint and like nothing. Because it ran out of black like halfway through and started putting it real faint. It's like, you sucky, sucky moto. You cannon. So, guess what? I went to Walmart today and guess what? I didn't get ink. Yeah, I was real proud of myself because that's one of the main things I was going there for. That and soup because I can heat up soup easy. And uh, bread and a couple other things, some water. Because I, I was plump out of soup from the last time we had no power because my... Uh, Pacific Gas and Electric, or my propane stove, will still turn on. All I gotta do is add a ma match to it. So I can still cook. So that's awesome sauce. But, it's just... The last couple of things I needed. I got some Top Ramen. Hallelujah! Anybody else love Top Ramen? I love some good Top Ramen. I take and I make some some tri-tip or some steak or some chicken or shrimp and I add it into the top ramen. Maybe some fresh veggies. Oh yeah. You got yourself that's the ramen pack, that's just your starter. That's just your starter. That's your sauce and your base or your noodles. And then you add everything else to it. Oh, so, while I'm speaking of food, uh, Friday I will have, um, yeah, Friday I will have how to make half and half toast, bullseye, whatever you like to call it. I've always called it half and half toast. That's how, or that's what I know it by, ever since I was a wee little kid, with half and half toast. So Friday, I'll have that, regardless, because I'll hook up the I'll generator running for the fridge, so I'll just plug in the light so I can record off of that Thursday night. That'll be exciting. Half and half toast. I haven't had half and half toast in a little while. I'm excited to show you guys how to make that. And then in two weeks after that I'll have what I call breakfast pizza. It is so, so yummy. 
But anyways, if you guys have been awesome, I'm a diamond painting, crafting channel, and I'm, I'm putting up cooking videos. I used to always put up cooking videos around Thanksgiving. I don't know if I'm going to be doing any cooking because it looks like I might be going to my brother's house because... My dad's going to my uncle's house across the street. And... I may just be stuck out of luck for Thanksgiving. I mean, I'll be going to my brother's house and I'll have Thanksgiving, but... At least I have my brother there. be nice to have the whole family together, but that that's never really an option with my family. The problem with my family is we're all the same. We're all friars. We're all a bunch of assholes. We get around each other, and next thing you know, it's a big old brawl. So, we stay away. So, so far, this canvas, I I am really, really liking it. Um, I thought there was some popping drill issues at first. But, I'm not feeling anything anymore. Everything feels really good. Oh, there's one right there, but... It's like one out of all of this. Yeah, I feel really good. Plus the diamond quality in this kit is really nice. So... I had to make a new clip there. I was about ready to run out of time. So I shut it off. Went and got something to eat. I'm back. So, did I talk about my secret Santa? I think I did, but I can't remember. See? I can't remember. If I didn't say anything about my Secret Santa, I got my Secret Santa present. They're phenomenal. I love them. So I've been coloring a lot. I think I did talk about it. Now that I'm saying it, I think it, I, I think I did. Yeah. Dork. Anyways, Oh my lord, I just had this big hellacious sneeze attack. I had to pause you guys real quick. <sighs> and then Trapper started cracking me up over here. He's over here laying in the, in the recliner. Well, my leather chair that he absolutely loves. Here in the craft room. And I don't know if you guys follow me on Instagram, if you do, and you didn't miss, or if you didn't see the Instagram post, I'll show you guys here in just a second, but it was hilarious. 
absolutely hilarious. It was part of the coloring last night, trying to find, my issue is, is I never want to settle on a page because it has too much on it and I'm still too, um, I don't know, I get nervous, I guess, when there's a lot of coloring going on on a page. I'm still trying to find a coloring book that will help you help me with that. But I don't need any more damn coloring books. I got like 24 of them now or something. I just need to start coloring more. Dividing my time up to color. But anyways, so we're sitting here and I'm like going through books and my, my favorite books right now are the Native American Indian books and it's a lot of uh, pictures of women that's like my favorite thing right now so I'm like, I don't know. So he starts mouthing off to me, and I'm like, all right, well, let's get your two cents in on this, mister. So I'll show you guys the video. It may, it's like a minute long. Okay, it's this one. Oops, hold on. That's at the end. Because you're a bad. Oh, can I have a shake? Thank you. That was more like a five. No, it's not time to chew on my hand. You're a weirdo. What book do you want me to color in? That one? Is that the book? He just left the room like, whatever, Dad. Uh, that was hilarious. That's uh, an every night occurrence with him. Like, he gets bored, he starts talking to me like that. Like, I'm just like, trap, okay, okay just, will you just shut up five minutes? He'll sit over there in the chair the whole time. Just talking... Talking his BS over there to me, and I'm just like, I have not a clear in the world to hear what you have to say right now because I am busy. And then I go over and I hang with him for a minute, and then he's like, okay, you're good, Dad. Ah, <sighs> goofball. I love my boy. But he's a goofball. Should have named him Goose. Oh. So yeah, I hope to get some ink for my printer here soon so I can start doing some more coloring because I'm not wasting my coloring book the color in. I don't do that. I just make copies of the pages. I can have the page to color in later on down the road. Or make another copy. That's how I could do it. So, 
I hope I might just order some online so it can get here because I don't feel like running into Walmart again. Plus, they didn't have much of anything at Walmart. Probably be cheaper to buy it offline anyways. I think the one I needed was 20 bucks for the black. Anyways. So, yeah. It's going to be another sucky no power for a few days. But, what do you do? Oh, I didn't even tell you guys, like, what I found out. So, I found out that... State of California is actually investigating the power company because... They don't think it's right that they're shutting power off to so many people. They think it has to be... They think they have to do it differently somehow so people aren't... Without power for so long, they think they they could be off for a twenty four hour period of time, and that's it. They have to shut it back on or turn it back on, which would be fine if they tell us, "Hey, you're gonna have no power for this whole day." Cool. And that night, fine. I got YouTube, I got fireplace, I ain't gonna get cold. I just sleep in the living room or the fireplaces. And the only reason I say that is because I'm cold all the time. I'm never content. Like once it gets down into like the 70s, I'm cold. If I get into the 60s, oh, oh, I'm like out there humming, like, oh, oh, I'm cold. I'm comfortable when it's like 90 degrees outside. That's why I live in California. It does get a little chilly out, but up here where I live, it get colder in some places in California. My hair is in my face and it's making an itch. It's giving me a little tickle. You back for more? You gonna talk? Huh? You gonna talk? You gonna tell them what's up? This is, nope, I'm going to bed. <laughs> uh, he says <laughs> to you too, Dad. I am so excited this is coming out so beautiful. I... I'm trying to think of anything else I want to talk about. I hope that answered questions for being the moderators and all that good stuff. I know a lot of people know what a moderator is, but I've been asked a lot. I, I get people ask me 
after my live. Oh, uh, would you mind me being a moderator? Come hang out. You never know. But, it's all good. I'm almost done with this bottom section. This color blocking beast of a painting is coming along nicely. I can't wait to open up the next section to see if it's going to be color blocking or if it's going to go to confetti because there was some confetti at that end down there down down there there was some confetti but not that bad so we'll see when we get when we get down there I do need to go back to Crafty Mint on Amazon and figure out if they got any new images because as far as this is looking, I'm, I'm sold, like, for sure. Sign me up for more, as long as they're wolf themed. Or something of that sort. I'm always interested. I'm always looking for a new painting. But at the same time, I got. to manage and take care of myself because that's an ultimately in the long run and a lot of questions have been coming in towards the the new uh, YouTube policy guidelines all I can say is, wow, if you want to hear more, go sign the petition that's going around. I'll see if I can find the link and put it in the description box down below. Try to help save us creators. from losing our channel or even losing a lot of off my channel I don't know exactly what they're going to do are they going to get rid of a bunch of stuff they don't want to see or are they going to shut it down completely I don't know but a lot's going to change I don't know how I feel about it yet. All I know is I signed that petition. I even donated 20 bucks to try to get it to uh, advertise. I don't even know what, what words they use for it to be, have it be seen by Senate or something. They had to earn up so much money. It was crazy how fast the money was moving on that they asked for 18 bucks and I was like well, I'll put in 20 and nothing wrong with that help out help save my channel that I've worked so hard for you betcha it's crazy what everything was going on right now, but 
Hey. It's YouTube. We're just gonna have to pretty much deal with it because... They're gonna run it how they wanna run it, so... We just got to... Take it with a grain of salt and move on. It may sound awful to some people, but... It's the truth. It's the truth. I can't wait to see the next section. I'm going to work. Ay, ay, Everybody has looked at me so weird today because I'm singing everywhere I go. Getting close. Real close. Oh, I'm not talking to you. So, let's see. Anybody ready for Thanksgiving? Since it is next week. I'm going to have Thursday, Friday off next week. Hallelujah. It's going to be... Nice. Although, too bad. My family's all doing something else. I'm, st I'm still making homemade egg noodles. You bet your butt. You bet your butt I'm making them. I'll eat them all by myself. Neener, neener, neeners. I can't have none. Let's see. Anything else I want to talk about? I think I've covered everything that I wanted to talk about. I talked about the power situation. I hope I can have... Uh, I, I know I'll have Friday's cooking video up. Because of the generator running the fridge, and I can just plug in a light to cook with. Because the generator, or the fridge is right behind the stove, so I just put a light by the stove and I can cook. So it'll be like camping. So I can't wait for that. I'm waiting for stuff to come in for the Native American beating, like I said. I got some clasp coming and some other goodies coming. Want to teach you guys how to tie off the beads and put in a What you need to put in to make it into a necklace or a, a, I mean a choker or a bracelet. That's going to be fun. Plus I want to correct myself with you guys because watching back my... First video and second video on how to make a Native American beading or how to bead Native American style. 
I showed you guys wrong. I mean, it it, it still was the same concept. I just I put the th the diamonds on top and ran the the needle through the bottom. You're actually supposed to run the the beads from the bottom up and then put the needle through to the top. It makes it a lot easier. After I did it, I was like, oh my gosh, are you serious? I did it the wrong way. But well, it's still the basic concept of it. I just, I was dyslexic for a day. Not a big deal. We could fix it. So I hope to have one of those videos up in the next week or so. And then if everything goes right, I hope to have another, or to start getting my paint my number back out because I haven't done that in a while. We got two more diamonds. J is number two. Good find. Number two in this. Hey, 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 hey. Trap. 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 Mr. Bossy Butt. Yeah, that's his that's his mean bark, his mad bark, whatever you want to call it. Cause he's got a couple different barks. They change tones on him. Like last night when we we're doing the uh, pick the coloring page, it was more of a a wine bark type thing. But he does change his barks. And we got when and it's very rude of you, young man. See what the next section looks like. I don't know if I want to start here and work my way that way. Or work in that corner, work my way this way. What do you guys think? Let's take a peek here. See what the whole thing looks like.
a lot of color blocking, y'all. If you like color blocking, this is for you. There we go. I'm taking those little bubbles out. I don't even think they're bubbles. I think it's just creases from the from the paper. I don't know which way I want to work, but I think I'm going to call it quits for tonight. Or for today with you guys. I completed the bottom. Yeah, it's going to look awesome. I think I'm going to go from the right. And make my way over towards the left hand side like I always do. White change. So I'll get that uh, sectioned out for the next go. I'm ready for sleep. I am chocolated out. So, I'm going to wish you guys a very blessed day, many blessings, much loves to everybody, and uh, remember, peace, and treat each other like you would like to be treated, and I hope you all have a fantastic day. Tell them bye, Boogie. Yeah, it's like... Uh, did you have to bug me? Later, y'all. Have a great day.